Hello, welcome back to Mysteries Under Lake Ophelia. We finally got a good lure, and we finally got a better fishing pole, so I'm going to equip that immediately. Um, and we'll equip that immediately, and uh, we'll finally see what these things are actually about. Because we didn't really get to actually um, try these things out last time. Because... The game doesn't tell you to press triangle. Woo! -hoo. The first thing I really want to do is kind of go straight to that cliff and see uh, how far this actually goes. The first one could only go down to a depth of two, and this one is already what is it like sixty something, sixty five. So what is it? Does it cast distance too? No attraction. I wonder if I can cast it further. Maybe that's what this is all about. Yeah, distance is 70 compared to 30. So already it's more than twice uh, the distance, which is pretty insane. I doubt I would be able to do it from all the way up here, but we can try. Yeah, yeah, not a chance, but maybe we can do it like from here? Not even. Where do I want to cast it then? Hold up, let's just go over here. Maybe we can just cast it from here and uh, It'll be better. Well, so much for that idea. Guess you need the best one for that, but let's cast it from here and see what we can do. Here we go. Straight down. Already I'm seeing some better fish. None around me, of course, but still. Ooh. This guy right there. He's not going to see me, though. I mean, I do have better attraction. Maybe he will. Yeah, there he goes. Come on. Come on. Nothing. Nothing. Wow. Anyways. We'll go over here. Maybe we can uh, catch that sunfish. That would be awesome. A little bit further out. Oh, jeez. It's still not that far. I just want to know what's down there. Like, my lure goes down further. It's just... Not enough. Maybe we can see how far it actually goes. No. It still reaches the bottom and still seems to want to go further. So we'll just keep on trekking along here. Again, I don't want bass or anything like that. You know, I'll try to catch from here. I'll see what we can, uh, what's over here. Nah, that was bad. Not even worth it. Ooh, there are swordfish down here. That actually is probably worth it. Oh, he's coming over to me, too. Come on, dude. I don't know if I want to move it too much. That's the thing. Oh, this camera angle is so bad. Like, inside the fish. Oh, I can see through it, though. Swordfish. You want to look at me? I'm going to try to get this guy. I mean, he's got to swim over here eventually, right? Yeah, he's getting a little bit closer. Bruh. How am I supposed to catch these fish? <laughs> Dang it. I really wanted that swordfish. Oh, did I go far enough? Uh, yes, I did. Hello, sir. Come on, sir. Oh, there he is. All right, we just can't lose him now. Swimming. Yes, this uh, cycle here is not that hard to figure out. Not gonna break off my line, dude. You're not gonna be able to. Come on now. This guy's kinda cool. He's like orange and green. I don't know what kind of fish he is, though. Let's find out. This little dude would look nice in an aquarium. <laughs> okay. Great input. What are these guys? Maybe I can get that, like, stun fish. Or that, uh, guy in the ground there. Did I say stun fish? Like the Pokemon? Hey, dude. A flounder is what he is. Now I'm thinking of my brain. I don't know how he's going to see this is the thing. I mean, my attraction... <laughs> my attraction should be up, right? Like, doesn't that mean that they can see it from further? Further distances? I know I'm supposed to move this around. Dude, I'm just not that far. How do I already need the, the better fishing pole? You know, it doesn't feel right to, like, stay out here once it gets dark but i'm thinking i might 
push my luck here a little bit because I only caught one fish. Maybe I should try uh, going to that cave because there is that green thing at the bottom of the pool, I believe. Ooh, this might actually be a really good spot to cast. I'm going to hit the ledge here. Is that a boat under there? Or what is that green thing? Oh, I was hoping my lure would slide. Oh, hey, okay. This guy probably is not worth that much, but we'll take him. Accept your fate, dude. Just accept it. Ooh, the line almost got broke there. You're so close. There we go. I love the colors on this one. I do too. I was just talking about it. I really want that one with the stupid head. Come here, dude. I don't know. He doesn't look super interested. Uh, whatever. We'll take him. I might have to uh, save some fish and get uh, get to be lucky or whatever. I just don't know what actually makes some good dishes. Maybe that guy in the sitting on that log will tell me something. I I also know that nighttime and like sleeping really only makes it so that um, the fish get reset. I think that's what the guy was saying. Um, so maybe it's maybe you don't have to go to bed until you really want to. Grab it, dude. Okay, so the attraction is. Dang it. Pretty helpful. Oh yeah, this is where the thing is, like right here, I believe. What is that? If I get the perfect cast, maybe I can bring it up here. Got it. No idea what it was, but I got it. Oh hey, it's gonna turn morning again. That's cool. That's actually kinda helpful. I don't have to keep going back and forth every time. That was weird. <laughs> it got like out of the water for a second. We'll go back here and uh, we'll see if there's actually uh, another one of those things at the bottom of uh, this part of the lake. I need to know more about this place. It's not giving me enough info for why this waterfall is so loud. Oh, well, let's see what we can find. I really think I remember seeing something at the bottom, unless maybe it was like a flower that I actually ended up seeing. Yeah, okay. oops. Good throw. At least, if anything, I can get close to it. Huh. Oh, they're like clams or oysters or whatever. Okay. It still is just like I need the uh, the better fish for this. Or the, the better uh, fishing pole. Because I'm not getting anything. Can I even get this guy? He was looking at it, but I'm going to get way too far away. Dude, this guy's slow. Come on. Oh, and he fights really hard. Okay, that's fine. Almost got away. Uh, maybe I should try to cook some of them, but I'll, I'll wait, I'll wait. We'll keep catching some here. Yeah, it does make it easier to catch these guys for sure. And I already cooked four tunas and it didn't do anything for me. I was looking at a Mr. Beast's YouTube channel earlier. And I went back to like his first videos that he kind of put out there. The first one ever. Well, of course it has like 22 million views now. But um, it was like YouTube, like Saw parody. It was cool to see like, uh, I don't know where he came from, I guess. Didn't come from... Mysteries of Lake Ophelia, though. Grab the tuna, boy. Don't do it, sir. You're not funny. I'm kind of done. I kind of want to take these back and just see how much they're actually uh, worth here. And I really want to find out what that uh, lure is about. I wonder if we, like, stood here until it became night. Like, if we could see the fire turn on, but... I don't know. We'll either see it or we won't. I already get that. Something made it. It's 1,500. This one's 23, bruh. I don't got money. I don't got that kind of money, bruh. Oh, also, maybe my... Yeah, right here. Moonfish. Oh, bruh. Well, that would have been helpful. So it was a lure. And if I just... Oh, my God. So basically, I wasted a bunch of money when I could have just got the cheaper one here. Then got this and just used that because... 
That one's only slightly better. Fishpedia. So these are the ones that we only catch, I'm guessing. And there's 32 of these guys. Holy crap, only 55. I knew they weren't going to be worth anything. But maybe we can cook them up into something. Stoplights are 55 too, so they're just as much. Let's go to bed and cook them up. Dang it! Can't sleep. So you can only sleep at night. Even though I stayed up for a whole 24 hours. So it really seems like the best spot to cast with this fishing pole at least is uh, over there. I don't know, maybe I'm missing something over here too. I wish there was some stuff to do like on land too. At least I can find like a lure around. Just like, I don't know, somewhere in this field. I don't remember if I already tried this over at the cave or not. I wanted to see what was up there. Okay. <laughs> My fishing pole's going... Okay, up the tree. Yes, perfect. Is there anything new in this shack? Probably not. There's no use cooking now when I already fished this whole place out. Um, maybe we'll get a few freebies here. What is that? What? That actually gave me chills. I don't... That scared me so bad. We're just... Uh, I was going to say we're just not going to talk about that, but I kind of have to. Okay, first of all, the fireflies that I definitely saw the first time, those must have been eyes. And also, is that happening just because I didn't go to sleep the last time? Is it like playing in my mind? Maybe that's a secret to this game. Like, if you don't sleep, you get better stuff. But are weird things to happen but i'll do that next time i still need the i still need the best loot is a problem so like once you get the best loot then you then you try to go for that try to like not sleep and stuff or is that because of something else maybe it's because i got that lure i heard someone went missing around here years ago it's just a rumor but still please be careful out there kid i'm kind of afraid of this stump anymore but, anyways, I don't know what I'm supposed to be, like, cooking and everything to make an actual good meal. And so far, I've really only cooked the same thing. Please be something good. Oh, my God. Dubious dish, once again. Slightly luckier, at least. At least it's something. Still, what? how am I supposed to know what makes me actually lucky? I wonder if I use that moon lure, like, even though it's worse, maybe it does something else for me? Let's try it, let's try it. They might work better for these guys, I don't know. It definitely does not. There he goes. I don't know, he did seem to go faster with it. Maybe it does something special up here, though. Oops, I fell. Oh, I don't know, it's just... This game is so weird sometimes, I thought maybe it might do something. One of those ore fish would be incredible too. Oh, dude, I'm right next to him. Please, yes! Hopefully he doesn't explode from going up so fast. Like a blobfish or something. Just give up. Good. Okay, what is this? This guy has a huge head. Alright, that's all he has to say about it. The other big-headed guy is coming. Okay, that's the death limit. Wow, I could... If I had the better uh, fishing pole, I could get one of those ore fish. That'd be awesome. There's that green thing again. Does it only happen at night or something? Or in the evening? How much do those big-headed guys sell for? flower horn only 65 it's not even worth it dude i just don't i just don't have enough money like what do you want me to do about it something there yo 
Okay. We found something. And right by the green plant, it's right there. This might actually be pretty perfect. Yes, slide. Perfect. Yes. The morning stone. We also miss a lure here. Um, depth 100, though. I don't know. If I like this... Well, the only way I can really use this is if I go over there. Also, is it just me or this real... Still not casting that far. This actual fishing pole, I mean. <gasps> yes! We're probably going to get still $50 or something stupid like that. Because none of these guys are worth anything. There we go. Finally, my first halibut. It's so flat. Oh my god. The flounder is only worth 35 anyways. Whoa. This guy needs to tell me something important. Oh my god, I just wasted money on the first thing, and it doesn't even matter. I was spamming eggs. And it sucks. Oh, why did I do that? I've been kind of just walking around, and I've just realized... I kind of want to stop playing this game, so... <laughs> uh, I think that's gonna end it here. Um, I know nobody's gonna watch this, but... If you happen to stumble by this video... Uh, I guess thanks for watching.